In the event of a global disaster, people are always looking for ways to reach out and aid those left in the aftermath. An efficient and beneficial way of doing this is through social media. Now, being a social media director for a humanitarian aid organization, I would use the following tactics to create awareness and raise money. Fastball. With over 500 million active users, Facebook is a great way to inform and collect donations. The best way to go about this is to set up a public page for the cause, which will allow users to contribute through PayPal with just one click of the mouse, and that's money in the bank. In the process, we'll also be building a large community around our organization. Now, Twitter is another superb social network where trending topics can become viral at an exponential rate. Setting up a custom hashtag through our organization's Twitter account, we can help spread the word of a specific disaster, connect those missing people to their family and friends, as well as accept donations. Now, creating a YouTube channel for a humanitarian organization is vital in order to reach out to people looking to donate money. Creating a video with actual footage of the disaster burns a more vivid image in the one's mind than that of reading text off of a page. Adding a donation button and link to our organization's website throughout the video will also raise a large portion of money and create exposure to our website. Now let's face it, the world has gone mobile. Almost everyone carries a cell phone from day to day. Setting up what is known as a text donation can raise money by the millions. The Red Cross did this for the earthquake in Haiti and raised over $30 million. Um, winning! An example of this would be text DONATE to our designated number, which will charge a set amount to their mobile carrier. Using social utilities such as Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, text donations, as well as a MySpace page and tap in the dense network such as colleges, we can manufacture a donation potential that will eclipse anything in the past, inform the people in the gray areas, and make them aware of the global disaster as well as our organization in the process. By the way, here's a sample of my blood for the drug test. Tiger blood.